Hey, what's up, everybody? It is Luke Beller. So apparently the Packers have met with a wide receiver. A wide receiver from Northwestern, Ramad Chiakioa Bowman. Um, it came out from Justin M. This guy seems to be the guy that just knows about every single um, virtual meeting teams are having with draft prospects. So it says, Northwestern wide receiver Bowman led the Wildcats in receiving yards and touchdowns in 2020. Bowman has met virtually with the Colts, Packers, and Cowboys. The Saints and Dolphins are among the other teams that have also shown interest. And also, this is um, on the Packers wire. Um, they put out this article sort of letting, breaking down this guy. So taking a look at Bowman and his time in college, he played in 47 games, caught 82 passes for 986 yards and 8 touchdowns in 2020. Uh, so he led his team in receiving yards in 2020 and receiving touchdowns, set a new career high in catches, and earned all Big Ten honorable mention rec recognition. So he seems to have a great season in the um, in 2020. The thing is, though, when you sort of take a look at him and sort of where he ranks and where people sort of think he will be drafted, as you can see, see this other tweet here, um, it says, Ramad Chiakioa Bowman is a wide receiver prospect in the 2021 draft class. He scored a 4.05 RAS out of possible 10. Um, this ranked 1,488 out of 2,499 wide receivers from uh, 1987 to 2021. Uh, we take a look here, it says Bowman ran a slow 40 yard dash, but was quick in the three cone drill, making him a potential late round or undrafted free agent option for the Packers. So this doesn't seem to be like a top top caliber, first round, second round, third round kind of guy. He seems to be more of a seemingly a late round wide receiver, potentially even an undrafted wide receiver. Um, they did say that Gutekunz was at the um, Northwestern's pro day, so we got to see him up close and personal. So. Maybe the Packers see a guy like this who they can get for cheap, uh, potentially come in here and add another wide receiver to the group. And of course, one of the biggest debates in the past couple of years has been, you know, do the Packers really need to come in and draft a wide receiver? Last year, everyone thought the Packers, or lots of people thought the Packers should come in and get a wide receiver and to have like a true number two wide receiver. And lots of people still seem to believe that and lots of people want the Packers to pick a wide receiver in the first round. Obviously, everyone has their own idea of what the Packers need to do. Um, so it's honestly, I'm curious to see where the Packers do come in because I, I feel like they will draft a wide receiver. The question is where? I don't have a clue. Uh, I feel like it would make more sense, maybe middle rounds. Maybe they can get a guy like this really late if they really see potential in this guy, if they see more than maybe than maybe other people may see in him. But let me know what you guys think about this guy in the comments down below or if there's any other wide receiver prospects in the draft that you guys think the Packers should come in and draft. But that's gonna be all for today. Drop a like if you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys on the next one.